Yeah. So that should save us a little bit in mass, I think. And these shall be our main shoots. Uh, the well, we we'll still have another uh, drogue shoot just in case. Let's say eight thousand meters uh, for pre-deployment, and deployment will be at uh, one thousand five hundred meters. Sure. Uh, this will be a main shoot here. Want the touchdown speed? Um, I don't know. Let's make it eight. I mean, we have this as well there to slow it down, and like we have four parachutes, it'll it'll uh, go pretty slowly. Altitude pre-deployment. We'll have it go off at uh, six hundred. Well, pre-deploy at one thousand meters. Deploy at uh, suppose seven hundred is fair enough. There we go. Okay, is that all we uh, wanted from uh, uh, the our uh, simulated capsule? <laughs> uh, we also want, of course, couplers. We'll have this one be two meters uh, in diameter. Uh, I hmm, we have this escape tower. Yes, yes, it will be the uh, launch abort thing. Uh, we don't need anything, uh, any except you know what? We should have some RCS here as well. Can we have any? Uh, we'll add yet another uh, structure on this. Uh, fine. Fine, we'll have yet another structure. Do we want it to be above or below our... Uh, pod, whatever. It's the... It's got only 12 meters per second impact tolerance. It's kind of... I don't even know where, what uh, we should have it at. Uh, shape it's fine like that. We'll have it very small. Uh, it will be... I don't know what... Uh, we'll have some kind of a RCS view. Uh, Let's just call it propellant, just just to be uh, safe. Uh, command and control, I think it's under. Here we go. Uh, we'll have like... Uh, I have no idea. Maybe it's uh, a fair idea to have these quad thrusters. Maybe not very big ones either. We'll have four of those, just in case, just for the extra redundancy, of course. Uh, though it's going to kind of clip on the antennae there, isn't it? Uh, fine. There we go. And these take, RCS has to be enabled, I almost, uh, that could have been bad, of course. Engine, what's it using right now? Nitrogen, uh, can we have, uh, what can we have here? Show, we can have nitrogen, I suppose. Uh, It 
it's a it's um eh, whatever tech level oh we can actually increase the tech level of this huh well I don't mind if I do don't need that overlay any longer there That might be a fairly decent life part, uh, kind of a thing. Let's just reapply these settings. It's kind of cumbersome that, but I don't know how they could have done it differently, really. Okay. And... Now for the engines. Uh, before we forget, we'll uh, uh, add, have these. On a uh, uh, correctly staged, I think. That, that shouldn't fire unless I specifically order it to uh, even the heat shield is... Uh, I, I don't know. We don't need an extra stage to do something like that stupid thing. Well... Um, why do I get so hungry doing this? Uh, what time is it even? It's 14.19 o'clock. So, what's our total... Uh, uh, not as high as I might want it, to be honest. I kind of did look around for the um, look around at the uh, engines we have access to, uh, but I don't think there's really all that much. Maybe we probably we is this multiple ignitions? Ignitions five. Yeah, I think that will be fine. Uh, so do we have any uh, other I don't think there was really anything else that we might want to utilize although I suppose we'll maybe test this uh, E1 engine yeah it will be fine what does that give me uh, 11,140 meters when the uh, that's the RRD that one can we have a, a b bigger tech level? nope it's at the maximum tech level uh, this has an uh, Where's the ISP? We can have it carry even more uh, propellant, to be honest. I suppose we should uh, start from the top. Yeah, let's start from the top. This is whatever engine. Yeah. Vacuum thrust. We probably want multiple ignitions, to be honest. Air throttle. <sighs> so... That's what we are currently using. It's got 338.6 uh, vacuum ISB. And I don't 
I don't really see any better ones. Uh, so yeah, that might just be what we are going to use. It's got uh, like. Let's see here. Where's the? I think it might be that one. That's decoupler. Nope, nope, no, don't. It's not the decoupler. There we go. Uh, so this changes that uh, vacuum delta V there. Uh, so we want this to be like 3380. Maybe it kind of. I don't even. It might uh, diminish the. Uh, if. This might not. Actually, it's pretty efficient, yeah. So we w might want it to be as uh, large of a stage as humanly possible. We already have 11,300. Actually, that's not bad. NK9. How about that one? NK9. Here we go. It's got 328. Uh, it's got not uh, that much mass. So uh, we might actually uh, save uh, this engine uh, there. How much can we have for that? We can have like more than that. Wait a minute. Which, which stage is this even? It's the. It's no. Ah, it's the. Uh, that stage there. Oh, okay. I actually, it is the. Uh, what I was uh, thinking of previously, even. We can have this go to a ridiculous uh, delta V there. Seems we have lost our music. Let's get something else uh, going. Show player. Hopefully that didn't uh, do anything. There. Uh, how about these tanks? And these parachutes haven't really been doing much of work for me. So, uh, to be quite honest, we might just get rid of them. That's how we get rid of them. There. They're not. Or should we try to make this super reusable? Uh, it's going to be very technically difficult to do it. How many missions will this specific rocket even make? We might get some more technology when uh, after after we have done these uh, couple of missions we'll do with this uh, and we'll uh, after that okay i'm going to check what's our technology looking uh, technology tree looking like uh, right now hmm Also, I might be more lazy when uh, cutting uh, stuff out because it's just so <sighs> so much work, to be honest. Now, uh, with uh, yet an extra video kind of uh, to work. Uh, to so we will be getting the early Hydrolox engines. And that's going to be a significant alteration to our 
space program. These have over 400 engine ISP in vacuum. That's significant. And 10 ignitions for that. 10 ignitions. Look at these engines. They are awesome. They don't even weigh that much. We really want these engines, but uh, after we get those, then we'll start thinking about uh, more reusability. Uh, like, we'll... That sounds reasonable. A reasonable plan, I'd say. When we start really uh, sending many satellites, a whole lot of satellites, that's uh, kind of... Uh, also. You know what, I have this uh, RC, uh, RSS Delta V map here as well. Uh, let's see here, we... Uh, 9400 is too low Earth orbit, but... So we have even now, we are even now over killing it. This rocket is kind of looking uh, a bit silly. Oh well. Uh, it's fine. How about this? NK9s. That's an NK9 as well. So really we could even overkill it even more. If we so wished. Uh, what scares me though is uh, whether uh, all the staging is going to go uh, correctly. That's a scary part. What's that engine number six? It's... Well, stage number six. It's... Uh, Probably some kind of a... Is, is it this? No? It's a... Uh, where's the... Uh, it's fourth... There, there, there we have a... Uh, sixth... We might want some more SLT for that. Uh, we also have to t keep an eye on these... Uh, Sea level thrusts. It's also a good idea, I believe. So how about we have even more uh, of these engines <laughs> for that? So that will be on. Uh, yeah, it's still on the sixth. Then now it has 1.54. So, staging. That fires. Those decouple. Uh, that. Or these decouples. Uh, we save our expensive uh, engine there, hopefully. Uh, those decouple then. That doesn't look right. Should we... Uh, shouldn't we have this... These be uh, decoupling uh, later. No, not decoupling, but... Firing later. Hmm. Maybe like this. Those fire, those fire, it's the sixth one, right? That's the eighth. It's only got 0 0.4 sea level thrust, actually. We need more, I do believe. 0 0.8, that's not quite enough. 1.7, maybe. Those decouple, those, yeah, well, 
think these uh, are might still be correctly uh, attached, hopefully. Yeah. We only removed the parachutes that weren't doing anything for us anyway. Yeah. So then that fires after uh, these, uh, these, uh, what did I call these? Oulage motors fire, yeah. Then that fires, we uh, detach. Yeah, it will probably be fine like that. Then, uh, then we get rid of that stage. Hopefully, I actually remembering to do it or being smart enough to uh, think of uh, detaching that. That will be at that point absolutely unnecessary dead weight and I I in fact deadly weight. We'll have the abort uh, be have uh, this. Uh, activate and uh, our decouple decoupler also decouple yeah uh, that that's our abort thing uh, i think it it'll appear there but just to be on the safe side i kind of feel like having it on uh, another uh, another thing as well We'll activate this engine, and in fact, I probably should also activate the parachutes at that point. Maybe not. They might rip off or whatever, I don't know. Uh, now then, parachute. Arm parachute. And deploy the chute, maybe. Uh, w w did we only need to uh, arm them? I think we might have to just arm them. And tell you what, I'll have the deploy uh, order on here as well. Just in case. Yeah. No, no, we'll have the deploy order for the upper one. Yeah, and for this. Uh, we'll have uh, yet an extra one, just in case I press the wrong buttons, yeah. Do we have anything else we might... Ah, uh, uh, solar panels. Uh, let's have them on, on action group number four or whatever, it doesn't matter. No, toggle the solar panel. That's arming the parachutes. Yeah. That's seeming reasonable. Seeming to be reasonable. Whew. I never really put this... Looked at the RCS build uh, helper, but... Eh, it's probably fine. It's just some kind of uh, emergency supplies of ours, yes. Just in case kind of a thing. <laughs> anyway, we have a, a decent amount of delta. We, we can get off the launch pad, it seems. Uh, yeah, I think we'll uh, uh, test this out a little bit. Yeah. Where's the simulation? Here we go. Start the simulation. Hopefully I will still remember how to uh, use the use our rockets. Even though I have these long pauses. Uh, we sh I should probably have more of a pause before the uh, music track that starts here. Well, 
It's fine. Maybe not RCS just yet. Uh, activating that. Uh, and these to the 90 degree mark. And we have our mission objectives on hand here. Uh, 150 kilometers, uh, 6,500 meters per second. So pretty much orbit. Let's look at this from the lighter, brighter side. It's got this kind of a bulge there. I suppose it's fine. Uh, ah, yes, I've neglected to, to mention that uh, the video, the webcam kind of a video is uh, go going to uh, only have my voice there. So if you don't like my music choices or uh, the games, if you just want to hear my voice, you can elect to do just uh, that. Uh, or in case you want to uh, kind of embarrass me by uh, making some kind of a... Uh, whatever. Uh, you, you use it for uh, your own projects. Uh, I mean... Uh, in case you... Just be uh, kind of mindful that I'm also a human being here, so I don't really mind uh, otherwise that uh, my uh, voice gets uh, used uh, for something. You don't really even need to mention where you got it from. Okay, so uh, kind of forgetting uh, uh, the kind of a gravity turn I I suppose I don't have any uh, wings on this that's something I kind of neglected to have I suppose oh well it seems to be uh, flying decently well maybe we should maybe we should ha add wings but first we'll just see how this flies Okay. Our apoapsis is at uh, uh, 59 kilometers. We want it to be uh, like 160 maybe? Also, because I'm now uh, recording my audio as well in uh, uh, OBS. Uh, it, I don't know uh, what the audio quality is uh, going to be compared to uh, if if I recorded it in Audacity. I put it to record at uh, 192. Uh, is it kilobits per second? I have no idea at the about the uh, about the uh, uh, what's that in English? Uh, whatever. Uh, I am a human being, uh, although my role-playing group uh, kind of uh, debates all the time whether uh, I am an alien or a robot, or maybe both. <laughs> yeah, well, it's a bit of an inside joke, so it's fine. I don't mind being called a robot or an alien, that's cool. Uh, 
who doesn't want to be a Kerbal? They get to launch all of these crazy rockets. Who wouldn't want that? I mean... <laughs> yeah, they also die pretty horribly uh, at a young age, but... It's fine. Time to uh, perhaps this is decent, I suppose. We are. Uh, this seems like a pretty decent mission profile thus far, actually. We leave an danger. There is no more. Ah, yes, it must be one of those falling parts because uh, we have uh, like 12,000 or whatever electric charge here. This can, yeah, this has houses so much electric charge. That's also something I need to be mindful of uh, when we... Uh, actually, can we this... Okay, we have lost contact uh, with, I think... Uh, with our base, base because I can't activate our RCS or where's the signal? Uh, it's um, uh, wait a minute. What's this? It's flight computer there. Uh, how about these? We had those. Where are our antennae? I think these are the. Nope, those are not the antennae. Are these deployed? They are, uh, status says it's connected. I can't activate my RCS for whatever reason. Ha. Huh. Uh, doesn't my, this also have a, it has an omni range 200 kilometers. So if we had any place on uh, Earth, we would. It seems like we are connected to Kuru here. What's up with this? Um, is it one of my buttons that uh, might have uh, stuck, gotten stuck somehow? I. Tried to press uh, all of those other buttons to un make it unstuck. Uh. Ha! Un avionics unlocking controls. What does that mean? Range safety now. Control from here. Comms idle. Analyze. We are using electric charge, though. Ah, here we go. For whatever reason, now we can. Uh, no, we don't want our apapsis to drop. Is this... What is this? Yeah. This uh, makes it uh, not drop. Because we already got past our apapsis there. Uh, Don't stray off. Thank you very much. Must have been... Maybe it was just that yellow signal there. Yeah, it must have been something like that. Uh... Wait, we are dropping though. We are no longer in a... Uh, uh, okay. Th th this didn't really go as planned, to be honest. Well, uh, you know what? We can maybe well still fix this though. Let's see whether we can fix this. Can th we get this to uh, go higher than our dropping rate slow down? Does this have enough oomph in it? Maybe? Uh, 
Huh. How about I activate my escape tower to... Uh, it's the number zero, yeah. Actually, that, that also decoupled that thing. Oh, well, we are now going to make a... Uh, that's a good r launch abort test, to be honest. Uh, yeah, that's what's... That's, uh, that's exactly what I was testing right now. <laughs> Uh, do some launch abort tests tests before the real thing, uh, right? Exactly. Uh, also, let's activate our parachutes. Well, have them. Uh, wait, wait. <coughs> Please, no connection. Why? Um. Ca can't you? Connect to... Uh, where's the nearest thing? We are in the middle of the ocean. It kind of seems unlikely we'll get uh, contact anytime soon. So that's one... Uh, kind of unfortunate uh, thing about this launch site, the Kuru launch site. That might be a good reason to launch from the... Uh, launch from the Cape Canaveral. You see, it's got this uh, Bermuda thing here, it's got also maybe the Santa Maria uh, beacon and these... Uh, these ones, it's got a whole bunch of ones. Uh, it might might uh, be able to use in case uh, things go wrong. You know what? That might not be a bad reasoning to uh, launch from uh, Cape Canaveral. Hmm. At least these human missions that's that really matter a whole lot. We have already uh, used up that much money, 3,800 and what not. No connection. Can we get a connection at any time? No connection. We are... Avionics procedural exploded due to overheating. Uh, 965 uh, uh, slash 900k. Avionics. Uh, it's it wasn't any of our <coughs> capsules or whatever, but that's always destroyed. But it's. Mm -hmm. But they also didn't have that la large of a heat tolerance, either. I don't... Arg! It doesn't seem safe to be sending uh, uh, people on this. I kind of... How long have we recorded to this? Um, mm, where's my... Uh, screen recorder there. Uh, then a little bit over an hour. Uh, I'll split it in, into two parts, I suppose, if I uh, pause now. I kind of feel like uh, having kind of a snack or whatever. Uh, so, I suppose that this will be uh, good enough for now, so, uh, the, like, one viewer who probably even has left by now, uh, who still watches my, uh, 
video game commentary uh, by, I suppose.